Welcome to Total I'm Freedom Events. <laughs> Welcome to Total Freedom Events. Uh with that with Zay Faith and Devin Edwards. I hope we're here on Instagram. Hello. You don't see the man, but he is here. Facebook and YouTube. What is up? Definitely let us know where y'all are watching from. So over the past few weeks, a couple of weeks, I don't know. Uh, we have been going live and we are really just preparing for 2023. Um, I Like I say on every single video, I really love this time of the year, not for the festivities, but mainly because it just feels like, you know, um, I love like the whole energy of spending time with myself and reflecting on who I have become and the things I have think have done the things that work and the things that have not worked and you know how can we plan do review to make them better and i think one of the best lessons that we've learned this year in 2022 is managing our mind and we're going to talk about managing our mind in three different ways we're going to talk about you know how our perspective you know how it uh influences our emotions and being able to manage our minds, you know, um, our opinions, like how do our opinions, you know, how, how can we use them to manage our minds and also the vision? What is the vision and how can that help us to manage our minds? So the van, manage your mind. What comes up when someone says you need to manage your mind? What comes up for you? No, for me, like it comes up when managing your mind is like, Managing um, your your thoughts around the situation, managing um, how you how you feel about how you're thinking around the situation, like any anything to do with like how 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 we're functioning mentally and just the, the, our language, our our words, um, uh, managing our understanding of 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 a thing, you know, like really 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 stretching ourselves to 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 know and not just not just think so like one and one of those ways that comes in like opinions or and, and facts you have like your perspective you have vision uh lack of vision these things come into into tact when it comes to managing our mind and usually usually our mind is what's gonna direct us towards what we gonna do, we, we get to do, or what we're current, or what we're currently doing. And one, this is funny because one thing I, I was in the toilet. Uh, you know, you know, you know. Who, who knows? Who knows? Who knows? You get like you get a lot of vi- like you get a lot of inspiration, and vision when you're in the toilet. That's, that's a bit, that's a bit personal. But, you know. but 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 like, <laughs> but, but put me in the chat if that's if that's you. But like literally. I was um who's ever heard and who's ever heard of the concept like, like how you how you do anything is how you do everything. So you've heard about that, Zena. So, yeah. so yeah. but I mean we, we well we know that's not the case because a lot of people are good at one thing and competent in one thing but not competent in an, in another area. So people might be competent with their physical goals, but not really competent with their financial thing. But what, when I was in the when I was in the toilet, I was like, "This is this is literally what it is. What this is, how you view anything, is how you do anything. Mm-hmm. How you view anything is how you do anything, mm-hmm. and that's where it comes towards managing our minds. How we view everything." That in relation to where our the mind is our mind is being directed. So, and that comes like let's say for example, I might I, you I, you might you might you might you might like um fish, and you might say like oh I don't I don't like um this I only I only like fish. So because you view it that way, you're just gonna have the fish. You know you you're just gonna have the fish like oh like oh I, I don't I don't I don't think I don't think this um. This this uh this um this thing's gonna work out for me. So it's so so it, so you're not gonna do anything about any about that, right? Is it your it's your opinion? You put you, you place an opinion on that, and that opinion opinion can either limit you limit you or or, or liberate you. But, but that's something that's when that's when the management comes into place because you get to evaluate that. 
And then now, based on that, you adopt a new perspe perspective around it. So it's like, okay, I'm viewing. This is this is my opinion on that. Let me let me let me let me challenge that. And if it's not serving me, let me reframe that um, that opinion and put it in the, into a perspective that's going to empower me. And so here's here's an example. When we 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 know that everyone has um. Like we, some, we 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 get people, we, we get a lot of people like in our in our ears like saying ah oh, you shouldn't do you shouldn't you shouldn't go that direction or you shouldn't do this, and people a lot of a lot of social media are trying to uh, like get into get into our minds as well like the way whichever way it may be whether the the they're selling something or, or or telling us false news or or wh whatever it may be, but the one one of the questions that comes up is. Are we willing to handle other people's opinions against us? Because, and are, are we are we are we willing to hold on to our perspective, our our vision? Are we willing to hold in what serves our mind moving forward? Are we willing to surround our people, which is going to elevate our mind moving forward, against these opinions? Like, are you are you actually willing to do that? Like, are you willing to? Are you willing to accept that? Yeah, you you don't have to be stuck. Are you are you are you are you willing to accept that? Just because you say you're you're stuck, that's an opinion. Like it, 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 and it, and it, and it, and you can you can you can you can claim you can claim to be stuck. You know, you can claim to not ha not have money, but then you can have um, money in one minute if you create an action. You know, like these these these. These are these are these are these are things that's changeable. So and and again, we it's like you have got to change your mind before you even change anything else. So that's why I say like how you view view anything is is how you do anything. Um, mm -hmm. And literally, like you got you got you got literally got to catch a catch a vision for yourself. So you got to understand, okay, what what do you want? Like what is what is serving you? Um, how do you want to think? Like how, like how, how do, like like what 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 do you want your mind? What do you want? What do you want to entertain your mind? What do you want to entertain your mind with? Like how do you want your 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 mind to be wired? Do you want it to be wired like, uh, wired like pe like um, like people who make good decisions? Do you want to be want it to be wired towards wealth? Do you want it to be wired towards um good habits? Do you want it to be wired towards um? The, the best the best health you can have the, the the best um relationship you can have like how do you want your mind to be wired and so now you have to catch that vision for yourself and apply a perspective apply some actions that's going to support that and any opinions that 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 try to standing that it, you can't allow that you just can't allow that so yeah so you you want to you want to you want to declare and release anything that's stopping you Mm -hmm. That's that. That's because because the the managing the mind is is kind of that kind of step to greatness within ourselves. So, yeah. Yeah, it's interesting as you were speaking. Um, the only thing that kept kept coming up for me is I I used to hear like my grandmother and all her friends and everybody say a mind is a terrible thing to waste, and mm. it's funny because our mind. It's, it's, it's first of all, you know, it wasn't until I started doing per, personal development when I realized our brain is not our mind. Yeah. And so I'm like, hold on. So so whenever I learned that, right, I was like, OK, so if my brain is not my mind, my mind is not my brain. My mind is inside my brain. Um. Maybe because maybe it's energetic. I know we can go to rabbit hell, but when I learned <laughs> that my brain is not my mind, I, I became obsessed with like, okay, I know my mind is a part of me. How can I? And, and I know my mind is like controlling me. So how can I? Um, how can I use this thing to my advantage? Like, for instance, if my mind was a part of me, like you know, mm -hmm. for instance, like uh, my teeth. 
I know how to manage my teeth. I know how to, I know I got to brush my teeth. You know what I'm saying? I know, you know, I know how to take care of my teeth. I know where I can go learn more about my teeth. So I'm like, how can I, how can I manage this thing that has so much control over my life? How can I manage my mind? And so that's why I would say definitely uh, personal development um, is definitely key. It's definitely key in order to um, learn to, to 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 break through because I don't know about you. If, yeah, if, and if definitely. this is you, please don't let me. Please, if this is you, don't like let me hang here by myself. But have you ever just felt like something's holding you back? Like you're like, bro, I know this and I'm super present, but there's something, whether it's like some type of spiritual welfare or like it's something energetic, you just feel like something's holding you back. Like, has anybody else felt that? And so I'm learning through personal development. Yep. It is, it goes down to managing our mind, right? And so with, what what does that mean? It, it's the thoughts, it's our past experiences, it's our traumas, it's our, 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 our emotions, right? Mm -hmm. All of that makes up our minds. It, it's, it's like all this, like, it's all the, all of this, um, like these things, it's like, our consciousness, maybe even, maybe I'm going too deep, but no, so to manage our mind, no, no. <laughs> to manage our mind, we get to just like, for instance, if I want to have healthier teeth, if I want to, you know, have the best smile, the most healthiest smile, I'm going to go to the dentist, right? I'm going to go to the people in the place who can help me, who help teach me get my teeth right, right? Or, mm -hmm. you know, I'm going to mm -hmm. Google like things about my teeth. We get to do that with our mind, and that's where it comes to personal development. And throughout that training, throughout that um, that uh, that upkeep, that ma that maintenance of our mind, it really it really gives us a different perspective on life. Kind of like how you were using the example, like if someone chooses to only eat fish. You know, and so they that that is you know that's their perspective, that's their thoughts, that's their emotions, right? Around that mm -hmm. idea, right? And so yeah. our perspective, oh man, I remember when I was in the military, I had this one leader, and you know, it, it was so many times I just don't know what it was, but I would like they would always catch me like in the like at the end or middle or something. <laughs> <laughs> but but I'm like, bro, like you just walk past, you ain't even see the whole thing. And they like, well, this <laughs> is cool, right? And I'm like, and they were, I'm like, but it's not like let me explain. Well, the perspective is all that matters. I used to hate that. I'm like, you oh, first man. didn't know what you're talking about because you wasn't even here from the beginning. But but <laughs> honestly, and I don't even want to admit this, but they're right. People have their perspectives on things, their thoughts, their emotions from their experience wrapped around this thing. And they just run with it, whether it's right, wrong or whatever. But in mm -hmm. your life, right, in our lives, we get to um, manage our perspectives by educating ourselves, going to the um, the. Um, the, the 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 resources <laughs> going to the tools of people with the the results that we want and the interesting thing is there's no there's no wrong like we all have an opinion going into the second one right we all have an opinion of what is right for us and we can use this for an example whenever it comes to um um spiritual beliefs some people choose religion some people choose spirituality some people don't choose anything like that's your opinion it's just that you know based on the your perspective where you are today uh mm -hmm. we get to go deep on our perspective and actually you know low key validate our perspectives you know what i mean but, but through our experience through our research through our did i say experience um, not just listening mm -hmm. to everybody yeah. and not thinking for ourselves. We also get to think for ourselves. And that's when we get to develop our personal opinions. So, like, I'll be honest, you know, when it comes to us, like, we are spiritual beings, but we don't, um, we're not, like, part of a denomination. Like, we're not strict on yeah. one way of uh, worshiping, you know, and I'm just standing mm -hmm. in words so people can understand, right? But, but that's yeah. our opinion. And 
um we have no shame no guilt like you can't say anything to me that's going to make me change my opinion on my spiritual beliefs because it's my relationship with the source right mm -hmm. and, and our perspectives that we carry is based on the principles as well and, mm -hmm. and like universal law and stuff like that which is is something that as we move forward our vision for how we want we want to live our life our, our vision for how we get to show up in life um is supported by that perspective mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. there's principles and, and, there's, and the laws you know what i mean so yeah and and i would say to just to complete this thought is uh maybe i should have did it the opposite way but i think this is all derived from the 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 vision so whatever our vision is for our lives whatever our vision is for our life right mm -hmm. we can uh, reverse engineer it we can reverse engineer it and saying okay i have opinions about this this is the vision for my life okay um and and this is my perspective from my experience and we all get to um take responsibility and and lead ourselves you know on that path right i think i think yeah. i think the the i think and i'm just just trying to like wrap this up so in order to manage our mind in order to manage our mind we get to um we get to trust ourselves we get to trust our vision we get to choose we get to choose our vision we get to choose our vision and we get to commit to that vision right and we and we're allowed mm -hmm. to live it. so we get to choose and commit to our vision and then you know be have so have such high self-worth have so much belief in ourselves and so much belief in our vision that no matter no matter um who, like no matter what's happening in the world or no matter like what's happening outside of us we get to we get to pivot if we choose to but we also get to stay strong in our vision and and, and yeah, in our opinion and then and 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 be open though throughout the like things happening throughout like the more knowledge we learn and grow be open to the idea that okay our perspective could have been wrong we call only piece of what what we thought it was so i think in order to manage our mind it's definitely those layers um and 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 through managing our mind it's a practice it's not like oh well um the, the you know i mean if you choose to but in order to grow and and to strive definitely managing our mind it's work it's managing our thoughts managing our feelings managing the new information that we are experiencing in our life and and, and receiving every single day so so i would say <laughs> you know if, if you are in a place to where because i'm always just thinking about you know where everybody may be yeah excuse me mainly based on my personal experience of me like just starting and like i don't know what the hell is going on but i can't stop crying <laughs> right or 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 you know like i hear this okay what's the next step right or like where i feel like where i am right now like i i, I see it i know there's still some more work you know and i do get to go deep on that work but for the most part like how can i get how can this become managing my mind? How can it be? Because we still have breakdowns. I know I still have breakdowns. How can mm -hmm. I get so good at not um, missing a day, missing a moment of my life because of something that happened? So definitely managing our mind is definitely a priority for 2023 because the, the, the stronger our leadership, the stronger our um, we can manage ourselves, lead ourselves, manage our emotions, manage our thoughts. The, mm -hmm. the 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 happier we'll be the more fulfilled we'll be because we will be in alignment with our vision yeah definitely yeah and it's like yeah we definitely have to, we definitely get to evaluate um how we see the world around us because literally like about like for for things we want to ex experience it's like it uh, it's our perception that kind of unravels that you know it's our perception that mm -hmm. kind of um pieces those puzzles together to experience the things that we want to experience and we have to see it before we even believe it. We have to see it um, before we even seize it. We have to see it before we can actually experience it. So we can, and, and that, we have to stretch our imagination. And like one of the step, one one steps that have um, helped has helped um, me and helped, helped a lot of people. Like 
is um, the question is the answer. I like to say the question is the answer. And here's the three, three questions that we can ask ourselves when, um, when stepping into anything that's new or maybe uncomfortable. Um, especially when managing our minds, whatever, in whichever direction of life you are in, are you willing? Are you hungry? And are you coachable? And so now, 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 are you willing? Are you hungry? Are you coachable? And break and connecting it to these uh, aspects of managing our mind, opinion, perspective, and vision. Are you willing to handle other people's opinions of you? Are you are you willing to um, be be steadfast on your opinion if it's if it's going to empower you or if it's mm-hmm. serving you. Secondly, are you coachable enough to adopt a higher perspective on what that opinion may be, or 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 an opinion on where that's or where you want to go into life? So, like, are you are you coachable enough to adopt a perspective that's going to help you? You know, that's going to really empower you. And then third, are you hungry enough to create and catch a vision for yourself that's going to hold you and going to hold your mind, strengthen your mind, expand your mind, moving forward into a better version of you. So you have to be, are you willing, are you hungry, are you coachable to to really embrace these things, these kind of different constructs within your mind to be able to manage it and then master it. Mm-hmm. And so these are, these are stuff that I go through my mind like every day, like, okay, like, okay, I'm out. Am I willing to accept what this person just said to me? No, I'm not willing. You know, am I coachable enough to adopt a higher perspective? Am I coachable enough to 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 respond better, or react better? You know, am I coachable enough to to be able to accept that abundance is my birthright? Am I am I am I coachable enough to adopt a perspective that I can achieve these 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 heights? You know, am I, am I coachable enough to stretch my imagination? And then, am I hungry enough? To surround myself in and immerse myself in that vision every day until that becomes a reality. So, mm-hmm. so yeah, and based on that, like that's part of because they and I we was, we've been on a revenue a revenue challenge. It's been this day one today, and um, a lot of these things around like wealth, identity, and uh, our opinions and and um, the, the mindset manage uh, the mindset has been. That's been literally a theme that pops up all the time and it's helped us so much but i'm like ask yourself like if who's who's helping you you know and we want you to really join us join us in, in, in like tuning into this so you can get that different perspective you can hear the, these opinions you can really catch a vision for yourself towards maybe what you want to do or that the and, and kind of released clear those those limiting beliefs you know really understand where your passions lie stuff how you want to serve show up in the world how you want to serve yourself and serve others if you want to do that literally join, click the link in the bio um or there might be a link in the description join the revenue challenge it's a five-day revenue challenge from december 12th to december 16th and it's gonna be it's it's been amazing so far like we we we, we upgraded to vip as well like it's been a great experience but like, if you're someone who wants to like really build a better, better you in 2023 moving forward, and really manage your mind and and go and be in the path of of, of mastery as well, like put that in the comments below. Like put 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 um put mind or put five in five five in in the, in the chat below, you know. Put a five. Put five. High five it. High five guys. High five. You know. Or like DM us, like five DM us high five, and then and we let's just connect, like and really build upon um, building ourselves. So yeah, that's 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 um, that's it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, and, and just just to make sure people here on Instagram really heard you is like, you know, definitely um, uh, cultivating our our environments, and so. The way that we cultivate our environments is putting ourselves, you know, in chat, sometimes in challenging situations, you know, putting us in, in putting ourselves in rooms where we're like, okay, we don't know what they're talking about, but I'm here to get the information. And so definitely being coached to, and we talk about this all the time, hiring a coach is, is what is what is 
helping us to um, get to the next level. So, you know, put a five in the comment, you know, or we're going to put the link in the comment if you want to be a part of this revenue challenge, you know, because that definitely is like just seeing how the three percent think <laughs> like you know, <laughs> having access to the three percent and seeing how they're thinking seeing their perspective seeing their hearing their opinion seeing their um vision and so it definitely um it definitely it definitely does something so so with that being said um make sure you sit down and take a moment with yourself and figure out what emotions, what thoughts, what perspectives, what vision, what opinions do you get to um, cultivate and develop with him for yourself? And we hope to see y'all on the challenge because it is definitely um, just like you said, we we uh, upgraded the VIP and we're like, bro, just day one alone was worth the VIP. Yeah, so we will see y'all. Let me see. Mm -hmm. Y'all know I be on, on Instagram. Y'all know I got to get my angles for my cover photo. <laughs> <laughs> don't see i don't care about y'all should, should i crop this one into a reel yeah oh <laughs> see y'all tomorrow manage your mind manage your mind let's go guys take care all right let's end this thing